Hello everyone, I hope you're all well. I just thought I would pop by um, and do a little update for my Instagram and my YouTube. I've made an announcement on Facebook and in my Facebook group uh, and I thought it's important to maybe hear some of it verbally so you can hear my thoughts behind my decisions for 2024. As most of you know, I've been a freelance designer for All and Create for a good many years now. And I've enjoyed my journey and I've learned many things along the way. However, as a, a designer, the most important thing for me is to create. Is to create cards, journals, any projects that I just love creating using some of my designs. Uh, and I've done that for many years. But uh, during 2023, I've spent a lot of time thinking about what's important to me as a freelance designer and as a creative just like you. And the thing that's important for me is having the freedom to share whatever I want, whenever I want, with no restrictions or deadlines. I find that deadlines can be very restrictive. When you have deadlines, you're rushed to do things. Um, you have to do things in certain ways. And I want to move away from that. Um, I want to gain back my freedom and the love of just creating for the sake of creating. Now, I absolutely adore designing stamps and designing product. However, Again, I want to move away from deadlines. I want to be able to release whatever I want to release, whenever I want to release. But I don't want that to be a constant thing. I want to release, you know, if I want to release some stamps in January, I'll release a few stamps in January. But then if I don't want to release for another four months, then I won't release for four months. I want it to be a little bit more carefree. Now, what does this mean for you as my loyal followers? Well, nothing changes. For you, my loyal followers, I will continue to hopefully inspire you to use your product, whatever products those are. Um, I want to continue to inspire you, but with more freedom. <clears throat> I'm sorry about my voice. Actually making this decision has actually taken its toll on me a little bit. But I want to be able to continue to inspire, but without the pressures um, and be able to release stamps at my own pace uh, without having um, restrictions or deadlines imposed upon me. Now, my style is not going to change. My style is my style. But what that means is if I just want to release one stamp, for a month, then I just release one stamp. I don't have to have any of that pressure on me. And because of that freedom, it means that I can concentrate on just creating um, at any pace that I want. If I want to create five cards in one day or five journal pages, I can do it. But my journey now is going to be warts and all, like it always has been, but it's not going to be polished. So my videos on YouTube are not polished. They are not edited to within an inch of their life. They are just me, warts and all, because I want to share being creative with you, including mistakes, including warts, including everything. I don't want to edit anything out. It's important for me that we, and me, we em embrace our imperfections, there's no such thing as being perfect. If we start to, I feel that if I show that all our cards and all our artwork has to be perfect, well, then that restricts us straight away. It stops us from creating. And I want to um, stop that. I want to be a little different than maybe anybody else out there. Whatever anybody else does is not wrong. That's what works for them. But it doesn't work for me. So moving forward, it'll be warts and all, Tracy Evans. There'll be Facebook Lives, warts and all. YouTube videos will not change. I will try and grow my YouTube video uh, and spread the love of just creating to encourage you to use whatever products you have, whether you use my designs or not. 
also I will be keeping my group so if we bring up my iPad here I've got a group here which is called Tracy Evans Craft Addicts Create Share Inspire if you click on that you will see it's my group here <coughs> and this group please please continue to share your work using any of my designs whether those designs are from All and Create or whether they're from me under my own name so designs going forward I will be releasing under my own name at my own pace so just share in my group whatever you wish now if you want to join me along this journey simply search for my group and request to join there's a simple question to ask but nothing difficult that's just to make sure that i keep the group safe just so we can share our artwork no hassle no drama no pressures and that's just there for us to enjoy for the next thing is it's important for me to thank Otoir de moi abs as you all know him to thank Abs for believing in me and giving me the opportunity to design under the All and, All and Create umbrella. I'll always be grateful for that opportunity. So thank you very much, Abs. And I think it's important that Abs hears me saying that verbally. And I wish Abs and his team every bit of success. I hope you shine and I hope you go from strength to strength as always and I wish that for any company in the craft industry I wish you all well I don't want any part in competition this is not about competition for me this is about the love of creating and the love of designing yes I'll hopefully earn a few pennies doing what I love but with no deadlines no pressures to release uh, however many stamps, however many stencils, whatever. It's just freedom. I'm just going to embro embrace the freedom. I just want to enjoy the journey and I hope you'll enjoy that journey along with me. So for you as a follower, a customer, somebody who just watches from afar, it doesn't really mean much change for you. All as it means is that Tracy will stay true to her ethos Tracy will stay true to her morals and Tracy will stay true to what she's always said, what I've always said. I will encourage you to use your previous designs. I will encourage you to use your new designs and I will encourage you to design faults and all. Embrace those imperfections. I will also, you know, sort of shout from the sidelines for all creatives because it's important that we all support each other. And going forward, the only change will be that I will release my designs under my own name. That's it. I will, everything else will continue. My workshops will continue. My YouTubes will continue. My Instagram posts will continue. And my Facebook posts will continue. And that's it. But I just thought it was important to speak verbally just so that you can, you can hear my voice and you can hear what's important to me. And I thought I would do that on Instagram. <clears throat> Sorry about the clearing my throat. Um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything else you need to know. At the moment, there's nothing else. I have lots to learn about the manufacturing process, etc., which I will develop and learn at my own pace. Um, I, as most of you know, I'm a technophobe, so it's going to be interesting going going forward. Um, but I will just take my time and I will keep you informed along the way. My, st As I said before, my style won't change, but because of this freedom, it allows me to release whatever I want, whether it's a simple little stamp in A7 and then I don't release anything else, I can do it. If I just want to release a simple A5 stamp, I can do it. If I want to release one stencil and nothing else, I can do it. It's the freedom. But if this kind of style doesn't appeal to you, that's absolutely fine. But I want it to make known that I'm going to be showing warts and all. If you're looking for a polished video that's edited, showing no cutting out, showing nothing other than a polished, finished result, then I'm not what you're looking for. 
But if you're looking for inspiration, a little bit of fun along the way and a design team that have got the same ethos, then maybe this is what you're looking for. If it is, then my group on Facebook is the place to join me. So I just want to say a huge thank you to each and every one of you that have supported me along this journey and those of you that will continue to support me going forward. I'd like to wish you all a happy 2024 and onwards. This has not been an easy decision, but I'm finding it a very freeing decision and I'm shaking. I'm very nervous about it all, but I want to go back to what I always said I was going to do and just enjoy the journey with no one telling me what's right or wrong, because as far as I'm con concerned, I still believe this. I'm not an artist. I'm not trained. I'm not a fine artist. I'm just a creative that enjoys doing what she's doing. And if I can pass on just a little bit of that freedom to create and embrace those imperfections, then I'm happy. Just, I hope we can all shine in our own way. So love to all and I'll see you all soon. Bye for now.